I was in a rehearsal for a special appearance on Rock Band Wars when the call came. Sorry, I thought I told everyone to turn off their cells during rehearsals. Can you cut the playback? Sorry, Birch, I thought it was off. Well, you might as well answer it now. Right, sorry. Oh, it's Sarah. Hi, Sarah. Is this Stargazer Borealis? Yes, this is he. This is the Princess Grace Hospital in Monaco calling. Do you know a Sarah Borealis? That's my wife. Please remain calm, Mr. Borealis. Your wife was admitted to the hospital about an hour ago. Oh, my God. She had apparently collapsed on one of the yachts in the harbor. We don't know why yet, but her vital signs are stable. The Princess Grace Hospital, you said? Yes, that is correct. We will be giving you calls daily about her condition. Forget that. I'm coming there. Birch, I have to leave. What now? We have a show to do. Birch, Sarah is sick. What? Oh. Uh, uh, okay, go, go ahead, Star. I'll, I'll call the network and see if we can reschedule the performance. They'll understand. Just just go. Thank you, Birch. I quickly drove home, informed Aurora of the situation, grabbed my passport, packed a few things, and then went straight to the airport, and there inquired on how to get to Monaco. I tried to explain my need without panicking, but it was excruciatingly hard to do so. Fortunately, the airline attendant there was helpful and understood. She even offered me a place to sit while they searched for the quickest flight. I was brought a cup of coffee which I held in trembling hands. It wasn't long before they had found a flight with available seats. It had to be first class since those were the only ones available. I didn't care. I needed to go now. They asked about a return flight. I told them I did not know when I would return since I had no idea what would happen once I got to Monaco. She made a preliminary reservation for me though and told me I could change it at any time. The flight out of Charlotte was short and noisy. Turboprops are the usual planes that make that hop. I was rather glad of the noise since I simply did not want to think. I made the connection in Charlotte for Frankfurt, Germany. From there, I would take another flight to Nice, France and take a cab to the hospital in Monaco. Once the flight to Frankfurt took off, it got very quiet as many of the passengers went to sleep. But there was no way I was going to be able to sleep. My mind was racing with awful possibilities that I did not want to think about but couldn't help myself. Was she sick? Was she dying? Good lord. I had spent the past ten years of my life with a closed heart in order to avoid this kind of pain. But I realized that life would have been empty and meaningless. Sarah made me whole and I simply could not bear the thought of continuing without her. If she didn't make it, I don't know if I could continue living. Lonely rivers flow 
to the sea, to the sea, to the open arms of the sea. Lonely rivers sigh, wait for me, wait for me. I will take you home, wait for me. Darling, I hungered for.